So we have got Rooney as the very first great to the game icon SBC. He is a four star, five star, 96 rated with the high high. He can play cam center forward and striker and he already has the quadruple play star plus. Meaning if England get the two goals, they get 97 for Rooney. If they get the four goals, more than likely we'll end up with a 99 stat. That more than likely being physicality or defending. <laughs> I don't know what else they'll give us. Probably 99 passing. But he has got the finesse power shot dead ball as their scoring attributes and then the long ball pass as his play style plus there when we look at his at his stats just impeccable very very good upgrade there's a lot of these greats of the games that look incredible in themselves when we do the comparison between his 91 um it's apparently not going to show me so that's fantastic you've got what a free increase on his pace four increase on shooting Passing's gone up by plus seven, which is nice. He's got five on the dribbling, and then he's got a lovely five on the physicality. And in terms of price, we're looking at about two mil. Now, chemistry style-wise, people are going for the engine just to max out as much agility balance as shooting. There's not really any need to go any more up, to be honest. I think that's more than fine there. You'll end up with a 97-rated striker currently in-game. He looks very good. The question is, does he play very good? So let's answer that question. And let's have a look. Get his first touch on the ball here. Can we go for a power shot? You never know. He's left us open, but lovely block in the end. I, I thought he was going to give us the whole space. The question is, can we find something from him? He's got more. Oh, okay. We got we got into a bit of trouble there. But he's got more play style pluses than we'd like. Barcola coming in. Drug put with the header. Keeper's got it. Dropped it. Nearly getting the second on him. That's a beautiful pass for me. Thank you very much. Into Rooney. What did we have? Did we have anything? Oh, if only we have Traveller. What did he have it was weak foot wise? He's got a five star weak foot. So he should be fine from any side. Obviously, he is going to be right footed as always. So that's going to be his more preferred side. And the finesse shot plus is going to be dangerous. You know me. Love a good finesse on a striker. It's kind of gone full circle again. It, it always does this. Like you have the exceptional over kind of overpowered uh, finesse shot to start with they then take it away and then by the end of it it just comes back little ball in drogba finish great great assist so i i always like personally having the finesse having multiple options on the shooting is always nice so having a bit of power shot of finesse maybe even a cheeky traveller the dead ball is okay but it's not necessarily my go-to good ball good ball a little bit of pace might be nice go across goal Good save from Tostegan. Maybe should have gone for the power shot there. Wide and open would have been nice. We haven't... I don't think he's got much head and ability in terms of like aerial plus or power shot. So that's going to be something that we'll have to watch. Get the touch. Good control. Try and push it back in. And the big thing with Rooney, and I do like him in, in multiple positions. Especially when he gets to this sort of rating. Because he can play that almost shooting scoring cam roll that works really really well and if you've got a cam already having him as like a backup striker so you play like the two strikers and a cam i think it's i want to say it's a four three one two you've almost you've got almost that assistant player but he's as good shooting as he is pa uh, he's as good passing no, yeah, he's as, he's as good shooting as he is passing, especially with the long ball pass as well, plus the added upgrade across the board. It's just a very well-worked striking card. It's, he's kind of going into that all-round game, and it... Oh, get the ball, nearly. And that that's kind of where I'm at with Rooney. Now, the big thing with him is he's only got 14 days to get done, so... I'm feeling Crespo-esque, at least with Drogba, it was 14 days to complete, but it was only 700k, whereas this is over double the value of that, which is okay, it's just, it's very expensive, he's going to be offside, isn't he? Of course he is. It is very expensive to, to kind of do, if you've not got anything, like if you've got no fodder in your club, get the flick, nice. Uh, this is where he could have done with like a rapid or a technical. That that would have been really nice to have on him. But if you've not got any fodder, it, it's going to be tricky with only the icons in games. Like if, if you had like an, oh, that's going to be a good block, an ultimate team of the season, a best of make your marks or, or kind of like man of the matches, that would have been nice to be able to kind of subdue a bit of the fodder because we've got two 92 rated SBCs and two 91s. If you've not got anything, that's going to be tricky to do. Why are you not making the run there? That's going to be tricky to do 
with the icons in packs because we've only got the icons and we know full well how difficult, how truly difficult they are going to be to pack. They're not going to be easy and if you do get one, you're probably getting one and there is a couple of them that are packable like Campos is there, Francesco is there, Rui Costa, some, some that are like, okay, they, they could be got with some okay advantage unless they've really kind of upped the weight on them which that's i'd say finesse shot plus easy that's what i'm hoping for but it, it is going to be tough i'm not going to lie to you it's going to be tough to get him done if you're starting off at absolute zero big ball in oh drogba's taking it rooney's going to look for it he's got the penalty he definitely didn't mean it that's such a shame for him to be fair he, he definitely was going for the, the the dive more than anything rooney's managed to put a red card on his name can he get the the 2-1 i think he should be able to we're going top left it's a good save from Testegen and unfortunately he is going to do what everybody else would do in this scenario, I think. Or maybe not. Okay, surprise me. So, let's see. Oh, he's on the edge again. This is going to be the nice one because you can, you can kind of push him out to that finesse shot zone just about here. Oh, and if you get a little bit more power, you can just dip it over the keeper, which is always fantastic. Where are you throwing it? I know you want to throw it. You don't want to kick it. Oh, good. Good interception. Bad pass out myself. Double ball roll. I kind of wish they gave him that 5-5 five five as well. There it is. Oh, I was hoping he was going to move the keeper. Good good stuff. He managed to keep him there. I thought he was going to move him completely when we got that close. Normally you find maybe he just trickles out a little bit to the side and you can get that near post in. Can we get this ball in one more time? Rooney's looking for it. He's kind of on the edge. Uh, he's not on the edge. Rooney making the run. Drogba. Oh, no. I wanted the fake shot. Damn. Good ball. Oh, run into a brick wall. Honestly, he's definitely gone on the defense now. Obviously, having the red card. But Rooney should be able to break it. Simply. Ooh, that's not good. Yellow card? Yeah, yeah we're okay. We're okay. Lovely from Rooney. And, oh, wasted chance. Rushing it far too much with that finesse. Managing to get it back into feet. Gets the pass off. Little return. Oh, okay. It was offside anyway. I was going to say, I want the volley. I know probably not the, the greatest place for the volley. But we wanted it across. Ooh. There it is. Drogba again. It's always the problem when you've got such a striker like Drogba. I, I don't know why I thought that was going close. But Drogba just steals the whole spotlight. He's that good. And I, 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 I don't know, what, what's your striker saying? I know Nunez is is one that's really taking shape at the moment, especially... Oh, that's poor. That's so poor. And especially with him getting the second goal, which means he's going up or has gone up to the 97. Looking like Uruguay are, are favourites at the moment with their results. That he definitely will be getting into that quarterfinals, meaning that he should be 98, which would be outstanding to, to see, especially... From an SBC striker's point of view, that's going to be just a great one to take into to kind of the account, really. And then also find that, well, not finding out, but being able to uh, get the 98 push gas is going to be another cracking one. Good shot from Rooney, good save from Tostegan. So already, if you've done Nunez, you've got two 98 strikers potentially or should be in the bag already. Drogba looking off him. This is the problem with Rooney. So good at the assist inside of stuff that... It kind of dwells on his striking ability. We know full well that he is going to be able to strike a ball like that. That is without a question. But passing-wise, like I say, the link-up play has been outstanding from him. Looking for him over the top. Little one in. Putielis with a header. Want a Drogba personally. Drogba running through. Rooney with a good ball. Get the second touch if we can. Ball roll around a keeper. And that is where you want it. Back to 3-2. Rooney with another assist. And Drogba's again stealing the show nicely. But can it come to this? Barcola. I mean, that was terrible for me. A skill move that, that is not needed. Shock. There it is. Oh, but he sees him again. Gotta go for it. Near post. Oh, Rooney. What is that? Oh, lovely. Now, that didn't look as, as good as I wanted it, to be honest. I wanted the straightaway first time bang with that for that power shot, but it was going to be an easy goal. Of course it was. It was absolutely on a plate. Drogba basically just moved two defenders by himself, and Rooney's just there to, to kind of mop it up. 
as we are finding it again. Rooney with a little bit of a header. Drogba into Rooney. Finds the Traveller. And there you go. Game over. Rooney's finally got his brace. There it is again. Good save from Testegen. Or oh, on the edge. Power shot incoming. And a ricochet off the ankle. And the guy's gone. So going into the overall form then. In terms of pricing. I... I think it's fair, like, obviously he's a good striker, he isn't quite the best in my opinion, like, I think he's very much up there, but when you've got the likes of kind of all the strikers we've seen with Nunez, we've seen with Crespo, we've seen with Drogba, I mean, the, the price it does come in quite expensive for 13 days, and I think that's kind of the big thing. With icons normally, you've got like four to six weeks that you can get him done in, whereas with this one specifically, uh, granted, it's it's probably for the end of the Euros, I can imagine. So that is, it's fair enough that I can see why they've done it. I just think it's a little bit too quickly, especially when the uh, more than likely you will see all of the upgrades that he's going to get before them 13 days. Like, realistically, England could go out this weekend. They could get four goals against Slovakia. They could get two and they could then go out to Netherlands and you could already see that before this SBC has gone. So unless there's something, some reason why it's there, because this is apparently not the only SBC we're getting as well. So that's the bit where I'm like, I would wait and just kind of stack up your fodder as much as you can and just see where you go. Because if there's a, somebody else that's cheaper and you want him and they've got 13 days again, you got to make a big choice here. Now, in terms of card, he's up there. He's a great upgrade from his 91. Obviously, I think that one is with, without a question, to be honest. But I do think when you look at him, it, he's a great card. But have you already got some top-end strikers? If you've already done Nunez, if you've already done um, Drogba, if you've managed to pack any of the Path to Glory good strikers, any great team of the seasons, he could be one that you potentially miss. Like, he's going to have a 97 potentially. The nine, Well, if England can get four goals in potentially, you might be seeing that by the final. You could obviously get a, a 99 stat, which would be nice. I think if I was to pick one, I'd probably say the dribbling because physicality is not going to make that much difference now. Shooting's already maxed pretty much. Pace is there. Passing's going to make a difference, but not enough where I'm like, yes, I want that. So I think definitely the dribbling would be what I'd go for. So let me know down below what you think about him. I do think he's a solid card. We will get Matthias up ASAP as we managed to very, very luckily get him. And uh, we'll catch you all for the next one. Peace.